Hi everybody, Paul with PTZ Optics here, and in this video, I wanna show you how to set up a tally light system with our cameras. What tally lights do is they allow the, the talent to be able to see which camera is live at any given time with a really easy to look at tally light. So let me show you this one here. Um, I've got one right here, and I'm actually gonna show it to you nice up close and personal here. Um, here's the tally light, and you can see that there's a nice little knob on the back to turn up and down the brightness. And on the, back, on the side right here, it's just a 3.5 cable. So that 3.5 cable allows us to, as you can see right here, let me go ahead and show you this full screen. It'll turn on and off. I'll just kind of just rotate this a little bit so you can see it better. When this camera's live, so when we merge to it here, it will turn on. You see that light turning on? And then I know, okay, this camera right here is on. So because we have multiple cameras, and some of you may have seen how we do um, cameras moving back and forth and fading from one to the next. Now we know exactly which camera to look at as needed as the talent on screen. So let me go ahead and show you the cable here. And this cable uh, is actually just 3.5 millimeter. So uh, it comes with the, ca with the tally lights and you just run the cable directly to the tally light to the control box. So let me go ahead and show you the control box here that is used. Um, this control box connects via USB and you can have up to six cameras on this specific uh, control box from Tally Light. And let me show you the, the vMix settings here because the vMix settings, I could not believe how easy this was to get set up. Um, in the settings area in vMix, you can click the Tally Light section. And one of the cool things is you can actually have a tablet or any old phone actually do Tally. And if you connect it to this, um, IP address there on your local area network, it will say whether it's live or not. But we didn't have a whole bunch of old iPhones to use, so we decided to buy the Tally Lights from Tally Lights LLC. The cool thing here is you know, the instructions could not be easier. These tallies automatically work when plugged in. All you have to do is assign the input to the number. So let me show you this here. So basically, when you're looking at the tally lights, um, the tally number has to uh, basically go with the camera number. So we've got five cameras, so this would be camera one. Now, the, the only thing that might trip you up here is you just wanna go to the next slide, COM port, you wanna make sure whatever COM port you're plugging this box into correlates to the correct COM port here. That can be find in win, found in Windows Device Manager. Let me just show you a couple quick videos of this working with the PTZ Optics cameras. Here's a nice one here where you can see the PTZ Optics camera. The light will turn off and on as vMix or the live streaming software you have it set to is going live with that camera. Here it is um, connected to one of our Z cams, which just sits, we have it sitting right on the top and we can easily now know exactly when and where our cameras are going live without having to have any idea what the video production software is doing because the tally lights are letting us know. So that is a quick tutorial on how to set up tally lights with vMix specifically, but these work with all kinds of different video production softwares. And uh, there's a whole lot more information in the links below. I hope this is a great way to add a little bit more fluidity and really help your talent know what's going on in your next live video production. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe below. We'll see you in the next video.